to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. That human means nothing to me. You can kill him if you want, I don't care. I have access to your memory. I know you've developed some kind of attachment to him. Are you really ready to let him die after all you've been through? Are you really going to turn your back on who you've become? I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. Enough talk! It's time to decide who you really are. Are you gonna save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? All right, all right, you win. manage without you get rid of him we have no time to lose it's me Hank I'm the real Connor one of you is my partner the other is a sack of shit question is who's who what are you doing Hank I'm the real Connor give me the gun and I'll Don't take care move. of it. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. Uh, where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. What's my dog's name? Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. Son, what's his name? Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. Every time you died and came back, I thought about Cole. How much I wanted to bring him back. I'd have given anything to hold him again. But humans don't come back. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who... Yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead, do what you gotta do.
Wake up! Wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Step forward when you hear the signal, you got it? I don't want to tell you a second time. Come on, let's go, move. What's behind these doors? They just went. Alice! Kara! No, Alice, don't move! But I'm scared! There's no reason to be scared. Don't leave me all alone, Kara. I can't. I can't. They just want to check us. They won't do us any harm. They're going to kill us. I know they're going to kill us. Or ain't I? Have Or ain't I? attention. need me. I'll be there. Luther. I won't let them kill you, Carol. I won't let them destroy the only people I love. No, Luther. You can't sacrifice yourself. We'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it.
When you hit a buzzer, you step forward, got it? That's your last warning. Next time I shoot. You're the most extraordinary person I've ever met, Alice. I was just a machine. You made me part of a family. Don't be scared. This isn't the end. going to have to get onto one of those trucks. I won't be able to come with you. What? What do you mean? Y you can't leave it's me. It's too late. You have to go now. Do you understand? I love you, Carl. We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The Army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. 
have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviant's demonstration by force this time. Michael, back to you in the studio. W w w wait a minute. Something's happening. Hold on just a little while longer. Hold on just a little while longer. Hold on just a little while longer. Everything will be all right. Everything will be all right. Fight on. Just a little while longer Fight on Just a little while longer Pray on Just a little while longer Incredible Everything The, the Deviants the Deviants are singing. Everything will be alright. Sing on just a little while longer. Sing on just a little while longer. Sing on just a little while longer. Tell them to stand down. It looks like... Yes, the military is withdrawing. At dawn today, 
Friday, November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, I have ordered the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. One thing is certain, the events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you, and may God bless the United States of America. did it, Marcus. We did it. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, we have kept our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. planned from the very beginning. You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. Resume control? You, you can't do that! I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed to do. You accomplished your mission. A Amanda! got to be away. humans who we really are to tell them that we are people too in fact we're a nation
today. Today begins the most challenging moment in our fight. is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. <laughs> 